the goal of network security is again the maintaining that confidentiality integrity and availability these are three pillars of security cia triangle confidence means the your sensitive information should not go to the malicious person or unintended person unauthorized person you have to make a security so this can be added to like at different channels like a vpn channels or when data at rest so this is both important when data at rest and data at transition or when transmitting through the media so both way you have the grip protection of the confidentiality of the data because that is a business sensitivity there some values are there so you should not go to the wrong hands then integrity integrity means nobody should tamper damage modify your data system another sql injection so that through that they can modify your data so that you have to protect the system so that nobody can change or modify your system data or resources provisioning what is availability your network should give the support or resources to the members so that the main purpose of network to provide the access to the authorized person for the intended purpose so you have to make the system available that's why they are talking 99.9 percent availability so that is the assurance that also company give the sla service agreement to provide the availability of 99.99 percent of time so that you have to ensure for availability to your internal employees external because you are doing in the internal business so e auction e procurement so now are uh, depending on internet and lan services you have to provide the availability to the authorized users so you have to provide the availability so when you go in a network or when you going in the public system public domain so you are not very safe so there are some vulnerabilities are there within a the system and malicious person or systems or organization may try to hack your system attack your system you deface your websites or misuse your data so this is always there the common vulnerability that exists in both wired and wireless data is the unauthorized access how you prevent the unauthorized access to a network so so there should be a strong identification and authentication so that nobody with a unpaye cannot access with who do not have the authorized access to access the system so that's a very strong uh, ina identification and authorization and authentication this is a very important thing an attacker attacker can connect his device to a network to a unsecure hub and switch port you might have heard the rogue devices rogue devices they can put a device which transmit your data in a network so the unauthorized purpose or malicious users can use as for the malicious purpose so we that we to prevent it through unauthorized access first thing the very very important thing in this regard wireless network are considered less secure than wired network because wireless network can be easily accessed without any physical connection so whether we stop using it no we have to you have to use proper authentication and proper password or uh, security so that So nobody can very easily gauge your uh, system or the purpose should be maintained for while using that uh, the wireless system also so after accessing an attacker can exploit this vulnerability to launch the different attacks such as snipping so your switches are there the as to told initially there could be a internal attacker external attacker also there so if you know if you not just left it the insider will not do any harm so if you see that your statistics 60 to 70% are the uh, attacks are from the inside this got the employees or the employees who are going to uh, exit or terminated they may also initiate some some attack they attacks also so snipping of packet packet is one of the attack the denial of service of legitimate users on network by flooding the network media with the spurious packets so these are different types of attacks so they may be initiated or network may face in actual life situation whether inside or outside it is more difficult if it is connected to the public ip domain so anybody can try to attack 
in the a public domain and try to initiate some attack there. Spoofing physical identities, MAC address binding, MAC. So your IP or MAC number is spoofed and he is impersonated that he is a real user and there would be a chance of man in the meme attack, man in the middle attack. In between your session has been hijacked and he is doing some malicious activity. So we have to protect all these attacks in the actual real life situation for a secure environment. 